Hi, in this video we are going to see how to schedule a macro to run daily automatically without any manual intervention. Uh, to achieve this, uh, we have to go through these four steps. I uh, will explain one by one. First one is the macro that we are going to run. Um, if it is in an Excel file, it should have extension Excel SM that is macro en enabled Excel sheet. and uh, I have this workbook as a sample. Uh, I'll show the code that I'm going to schedule. So these are the two macros. Uh, run from other macro 1 and run from other macro 2 these two are the macros that I am going to schedule to run daily so I have this file in this folder so I have the full path this is the complete path of the file and uh, the next step is the uh, VB script which is going to execute this macro um, so here uh, this macro, this uh, VB script can be found in the in this web page. Uh, I'll uh, provide the link in the video description. Uh, you can get this VB script, uh, which will execute the macro present in any Excel file. Uh, I'll explain about the VB script. So the, in this VB script, we are going to create an application for the Excel, and uh, and then we need to provide the complete path of the Excel file that has the macro, and uh, and then the yeah the macro name, and uh, after that the Excel dot run command will execute the macro present in any Excel file through this command. So this is the application object, and then dot run is the command, and you have to give the macro name. So in this macro name. We need to have uh, we need to have the complete file path within single quotes. You have to give the single quote at the beginning and the end of the file, and then a exclamatory mark, and then the macro name. So this is the parameter for running a remote macro. So I'm going to run macro one and then macro two, and um, after that I will save the file, the Excel file, and exit the um, Excel application. So that's it. This is the uh, this is the VB script that uh, that we need uh, to schedule in a, a Windows computer. So this is the step two. So we have the Excel SM file with macro and then the VB script, and the third one is the C script. This is already uh, installed in uh, by default in in all the Windows system. This C script is used to run this VB script. So open the command prompt and uh, copy paste and uh, as a parameter provide this full path. Um, pretends. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, we have to actually give the uh, BB script, not the XLSM file. So that's it. The C script, and as a parameter, we are going to provide the VB script. So give enter and if it runs uh, without any error then we are good to go with scheduling this. Now this is the last step uh, which uses the windows inbuilt option called task scheduler. You can find this application by, um, by using this uh, search or uh, you can press windows key and then S and then type task scheduler. You can see the scheduler, click on it and you will get a application open like this. In this you have to click on create task and then give a name 
and then description that will explain what it is this is description is mandatory sorry not mandatory and um, it's optional name is mandatory now i'll open the scheduler that i have opened they have already created so here is the uh, scheduler that i have already created just give any name and then you have to give um, entries in triggers and then action tab so in the triggers tab you will mention when the macro has to run so i have given as daily you have to click new and choose any of these options whether it's daily weekly monthly and then now uh, when it is going to start if it's daily you can give how many times it has to recur you can mention the name so uh, all the options about the schedule is available in the triggers once that is done click ok and then go to action go to actions and then click on new you'll get a window like this and give the c script full path in the program script and in the argument give the full path of the vbs file the vb script file along with the double quotes once that is done click ok now we are all set click ok so that's it it will add an entry to your windows task scheduler and this will run daily at the specific time that you have already mentioned um, so the workflow is like this the task scheduler will run the c script with the parameter as the vb script so within the vb script we are running the macro so uh, the complete steps uh, and the code is provided in this web page i will provide the link in the description you can follow these steps in detail and uh, also i have given the uh, xlsm test xlsm file and the vb script which you can download and try to schedule it in your task scheduler so that's it thanks for watching have a nice day bye